My name is Sujatha Patil. I'm an associate attending biostatistician at Memorial Sloan Kettering in New York City. My name is Ruth Pfeiffer. I'm a senior investigator at the Division of Cancer Epidemiology and Genetics at the National mm -hmm. Cancer Institute. The role of the statistician in my environment is to ensure that the best science happens. So we help to design studies that uh, try to identify novel causes of cancer. We make sure they are the right, of the right size, they target the right individuals, to be able to ensure that, again, questions that others are asking get an answer. cancer grows and it metastasizes, what makes it grow and metastasize? That's where statisticians can really help. Uh, there are ideas like uh, the microbiome, the proteome, the genome, all those uh, items, there are reams of data and trying to find patterns in those data and trying to figure out uh, what makes the cancer grow, what makes it metastasize, that's where cancer statisticians can really help. A colleague of mine analyzed data on people who were working with formaldehyde. It's a chemical that's used all over. And he actually, by very carefully sorting through this data, could prove that formaldehyde causes cancer, looking at the data. So after this, formaldehyde was classified as a carcinogen by the World Health Organization. So this is an example where somebody sitting down and through very careful analysis, painstakingly collecting all the information that was in the data, it was hidden, finding the needle in the haystack could actually show that it was a carcinogen. Well, I really love my job. I've been there for quite some time. I like that it is very interdisciplinary. I get to work with people from many other scientific disciplines, epidemiologists, medical doctors, biologists. So it makes the world really rich. I love my job. I've been there for over 12 years. I've been doing cancer research for 12 years. And the thing that I like the most is the collaborative piece. I get to work with a lot of different scientists on a daily basis, and we're trying to make a headway in finding cures and good therapies for cancer. 